Mock and this school year started with 1400 teacher vacancies in our state. That's according to the Center for Education and Recruitment, Retention and Advancement. Now a bill advancing in the South Carolina House could pave the way for non-certified experts to fill some of those gaps. News 19's Becky Buds has the details. The House Education Committee unanimously sent this bill to the full House floor for debate. However, teachers advocates are skeptical of its impact. Vacancies have been growing. This is a disservice to students in South Carolina, and if we can't find a way to retain our great teachers, then we're not meeting the mark for our students. The bill would create a five-year pilot program, allowing most schools to fill up to a quarter of their teaching staff with non-certified instructors. Patrick Kelly with the Palmetto State Teachers Association isn't crazy about the idea, but says having non-certified teachers in school is better than the alternative. Certification matters. The research shows it. It matters for student achievement. The shortage is great, and if, if this is a way to get one more student access to a highly qualified teacher on a short-term basis, then it, it's probably where we're at as a state, which is an unfortunate reality that this is even necessary. Under the proposal, individuals must hold a college degree in the field they're hired to teach and have at least five years of on-the-job experience. They would need to get certified within three years if they want to continue teaching beyond that. The bill requires ongoing training, but leaves the details to the schools and the Department of Education. Representative Cambrell Garvin says this is key. There won't just be people walking off the street who have no experience um, and who won't have any sort of help with classroom management, but these people will be undergoing um, rigorous training from their school district that will help alleviate any concerns that I had and I hope that others have as well. Lawmakers also tacked on separate legislation that would make educators professional teaching certificates permanent and allows teachers to bow out of their contracts once they see their salary. Uh, it's it's wonderful to have the bill with the alternative certification and to give options for bringing other people into the classroom, but we should also be taking care of the teachers who are already in the classroom. The pilot program would expire in five years unless lawmakers pass a new bill to renew it. Reporting at the State House, Becky Buds, News 19, WLTX. Well, the committee also advanced legislation requiring school boards to live stream their meetings. And also